Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this video. Thanks once again for clicking on the Penboy Boy Fountain Pen Review channel. Today, I'm really excited because as you can see here, Coles of London, which is the distributor for Visconti, they got ST DuPont, they got a lot of limes, they got a lot of luxury Italian stuff, just randomly sent me this box and I have no clue what's inside and I just wanted to share with you guys the unboxing of whatever it is that's in here. So, but before I get started with that, please make sure you check out my sponsor down below, Pen Chalet, over at penchalet.com and use coupon code GOODWORDS at checkout to score yourself extra savings on all your purchases at the Pen Chalet website. The description below will have more information such as links and whatnot. Okay, let's get started with this. I'm going to just slice this open. This is obviously a shipping box and I'm shaking the camera over here. I'm so excited. I don't know what's in it. I hope it doesn't have something silly or something that sucks inside. All righty. All right, I'm opening up from the bottom. Okay, it looks like we have an upside down bottle. Is this a bottle? What is this? Oh, I was right. It is a bottle of something that's fallen apart. It looks like a bottle of ink. Oh, this is cool. So they sent me a bottle of Visconti ink. It looks to be green. So someone over there knows that the pen boy is a big fan of the color green. I really like the shape of that bottle. I'm gonna put this down to the side. And then we have also in here, what looks like, ooh, a leather pen case. Oh my goodness gosh, look what we have inside here. We have Visconti Homo Sapien the colored series. It looks like I have one of each in here and it's like the gemstone. It has the stone on top. I don't know if it's an actual gemstone. I don't know much about these pens. I'm going to check them out. These are gorgeous. They're translucent pens and they have the in-house nibs. Hook lock safe locking mechanism, capping system, whatever you want to call it, and the green one. <laughs> They're trying to seduce me with the green and it's and it's worked. And this is a Visconti leather case. I wonder if it's any different from the previous iteration. So we have over here the older one. This one is a 12 pen case and there's got a bunch of pens in there. But as you can see, the logo here is metal and on our, on our new one is just pressed in. Looks pretty nice. Let me open that up again. Wow. It's a glorious sight to behold. I'm gonna review those pens. I'm gonna review the hell out of them. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, they didn't include the boxing of any of the pens, which is a shame because I think a pen in this price point when reviewed should be shown with the actual boxing, which I cannot do. Now I gotta bother good old Jonathan Lane and get him to send me the boxing. But this is obviously the power filler that everybody is familiar with, the vacuum power filler. It's all wet inside. I like that green, gee. I wonder if this is a double reservoir. I gotta do some research on these, but let me take these out. Man, these look nice. They're very shiny. There's your blue. I notice on the clip, it's not laser engraved. I like that. It's actual enameling. Anyway, stay tuned for the review of these bad boys right here coming soon on the Penboy Roy Fountain Pen Review channel. Thanks again for watching. Love you guys. Be well, be safe.